Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll show you how to keep track of computers in a SharePoint list. It's, of course, an example that can be used on any kind of items or orders. So I'm just going to create a new app in this SharePoint online site, and that's going to be built on the custom list. And I'm going to call that computers. And while I'm at it here, I'm going to modify a few settings in this. So let's start with the versioning settings. I always change that and enable that in my lists because I think that's a very good idea. Maybe you want to think about content approval in this context also, but I'm not going to do that in this demo. The title, of course, I don't have a title for my computers, but I do want to have a comment about this computer order. So I'll just rename this the comment and I will not make it mandatory. You can of course hide the title field but I find it's a much better way to reuse it for something else. So there we have a comment and then we're going to add a few more pieces of information around this computer. So let's start with the selection which type of computer it is. It can be a choice uh, just do a tablet, laptop, or desktop. So now, of course, these options are ordered by size. That's kind of how, how they appeared in my mind. But it's a good idea to have these in alphabetical order. So I'm going to change that. I'll just put them in the right order like that. And then you might, of course, want to put the right default value here. Desktop might not be the right, but laptop might be, be the one you use the most in your organization. All right, so there we have the three options there. And that, of course, should contain information, always. This should be a mandatory value. And um, that's about it. And of course, type is already used. So I'm going to call it type of computer, make it much more clear. Here we have the type of computer, and also I want to create another column for user, and that's going to be a person or group. And of course, somebody has to use the computer, so this information should be mandatory. And you want the, the selection to be only people, you don't want shared computers. All right, so that's it. And now we're just going to change the order of these things because now the comments is first and that might not be the best option so i'm going to change the column ordering put the uh, user first and then the type of computer and finally the comment all right let's look at this there we go there's my computers list and now when i create a new item there i have the user and i'm going to be using this computer peter kelmstrom and i want a desktop and the comment is fast as possible, like that. And uh, I'll save that. And there you go. There's my fast as possible computer. And that concludes my demo of the computers list. Thank you for watching this demonstration.